Luke, uh, a 3 2 win here, three points in the bag. Talk to us about that one. Yeah, it was a good performance from all the lads. I feel like we dominated for majority of the game and um, obviously we took the goals well when, when the chances came about. Yeah, talk to us about that first one in particular, the, the reverse ball from shot. Well, in fact, we'll go through them all, but uh, that one to, to get you underway. Yeah, it was just obviously a good ball and Sharpie, good touch, and then I've just had to make that run off Sharpie, and then he's, he's found me with a great ball, and then from there I just need to try and finish it, hit the target, and yeah, I've done that and I went in the back of that. How conscious are you when he picks the ball up and he's quite deep inside the, the Port Vale half, where you need to be and, and how soon? Yeah, obviously it's the way we play. Uh, he likes to drop in and I know he's got the quality to to get the ball and be able to turn and play me in behind. And as long as I make that run for him, then I have no, I feel like I'm going to get in most times. Looked like it sat up quite nicely for you as well. Yeah, obviously I feel like I've done a good touch across the defender and then uh, yeah, caught it quite sweet and it's just gone into the back of that. Maybe a year ago would you have probably thought about that too much or, or done something differently? Maybe, yeah, this, maybe at this last the start of last season, but um, yeah, I'm playing with confidence at the moment and um, and I'm enjoying my football. What do you make to the start of the second half as a whole? Yeah, obviously we've had a couple of games in the past where we've we've had a poor start of the second half, obviously conceding, and for us we obviously wanted to put that right and uh, what better way than to, to get a goal inside a minute and uh, yeah, it was a great start from us. Yeah, I've noticed that Doncaster seem to, if they do concede, it's a couple at a time and it's a quick fire mm. blow. This time, Grant said he didn't want any of that. Yeah, uh, obviously we just want to, if we do concede, we just need to go back to how we were playing, keep the ball and get them running. Obviously it was a hot day today and the pitch is massive, so the better, longer we can keep the ball for, the better it is for us. Your second, the Rovers' third goal, talk to us through, through that one, is a lovely ball. Yeah, it was a, a great ball through by by Gibbo and then obviously from then I'm just one on one with the keeper and um, it's, he's, he's made it into an easy finish for me at the end I've just had to slide it next to him but the, the goals came from Gibbo's pass. What's it like to, to get the three points and, and to come away with two goals and an assist? You, I mean days don't get much better do they? Yeah obviously I'm buzzing to, to contribute to the goals and assists. Uh, the three points is obviously the main thing and it's obviously a tough place to come. These are going to be a team that's going to be right up there. Obviously they spent a lot of money this year and uh, yeah it's obviously it's a tough place to come. You see what, how the, the fans, how loud they were when when they scored and I feel like a lot of teams might struggle here so it was, it was huge to get three points here today. That late penalty made things a bit more nervy than they perhaps needed to be didn't it? Yeah definitely obviously I'm don't agree with the penalty. I feel like the ball's going away from everyone, so I don't feel like there was any need for the ref to give it. Um, but you give them, try to give them a bit of a lifeline, and I feel like after that we we saw the game quite well and we defended well as a unit. Yeah, what do you make to how Rovers did see it out? Because to do that in this environment when there's still what 10 minutes in the game left, it, you know, a bit of pressure on. Yeah, obviously we've uh, we've worked on a lot of a lot of stuff on the training ground, and I feel like. As a, as a team we all know our jobs and we all know what we have to do in certain moments of the game and I feel like today uh, we, we saw the game out really well. What have you made to the week as a whole? Obviously got the, the two wins at, at either end and then the trip to Goodison in midweek. Yeah, enjoyed it. Obviously Morecambe last week was a was another nice win and then yeah, like you said the trip the trip to Everton was, was a good experience and I feel like even though the result was not what we wanted. I feel like it was a good performance on the whole, especially in the first half. And I feel like obviously we took that momentum from the last game, two games, and we've took that into today. And I feel like we performed really well today. Looks like plenty in the in the tank. I mean, you must have got best part of 90 minutes across all three of those games. Yeah, and like I said, I've been enjoying my football, and I feel good. I feel sharp, and. Like in the end of the day, I just want to play as much football as I can, and I want to contribute as many goals and assists in the, as I can. So, as long as I'm on the f field, I feel like I can do that. What do you put the good start down to? I think that's five already for the season, isn't it? Yeah, no, I just feel like the way we play, it, it gives me a lot of chances, and I feel like uh, obviously with the the front men that we've got with Sharpie and Einstein, they help me out massively with yeah. being able to to get an on goal. I feel like they distract and do a lot of work for the two centre backs that are up against them and I feel like they work so hard and it, it helps me massively with with what they do and yeah and at the end and I just have to finish it at the end. I was gonna say that the fact that there's only two out and out strikers is puts a bit of emphasis on you and Jordan, but it's clearly something that you're relishing. Yeah, obviously the way we play is really attacking football and the gaffer wants us to be gung ho all the time and to try and score and get as many chances as we possibly can and 
that's what type of team you want to be involved in as a forward and I feel like like I said I've been enjoying it and the more the more chances that we get hopefully the more goals I can get as well